How can someone just vanish into thin air? That's what the family of a missing Santa Fe business owner is still wondering three years after he disappeared. Tonight, they're hoping someone out there may know something and will come forward to solve the mystery. News 13's Amanda Goodman reports. It is a day that will forever be burned in Edna Nadell's mind. It's September 6, that's when my husband disappeared. He went missing, and that's when our life changed. It was 2009. 61-year-old Mel Nadell went to the Pecos Wilderness to meet up with some friends for a hunting trip. His friends left the campsite. He stayed behind. When they came back, they told me around 7 o'clock, he was nowhere to be found. His jeep was there. It was locked. All his belongings were still there. Search after search of the area turned up no sign of him. State police speculated on what may have happened. They said that maybe he fell in in one of the cliffs, something like that. Mrs. Nadell believes her husband is dead saying if he were alive and in his right mind, he would have done everything to get home to her and their daughter, Kristen. But she says that belief doesn't ease her pain. Not knowing exactly what happened, where is he now, what happened to him, it is really, really hard. Nadell and her daughter are hoping that someone out there may know something or may have come across something in the Bear Creek area where Mel was last seen. They are pleading with the public to come forward if that's the case. Even like a little thing, it will help us a lot just to put a closure. Mrs. Nadell has yet to hold a memorial or a funeral for her husband, saying until she knows what happened to him, she just doesn't feel right doing that. Amanda Goodman, KRQE News 13. The missing persons case on Nadell is still open. Last year, his wife was able to get a death certificate for her husband, who owned a Pilates studio in Santa Fe.